Vintage here. Happy to have you here, my Funko friends and family. So today, guys, oh man, today I have a story for you. I have a horror story. Oh, it's a, such a horrible horror story. It's a horror story, but it has a happy ending. Okay, so real quickly, the other day, I was at work, and I got a notification that three packages had arrived for me. However, the reason why it's a horror story is because I was at work, and it was pouring rain. So they got, they notified me, um, through my phone that the packages had arrived. So I got nervous because it was pouring rain outside, which means for hours my packages sat outside in the rain. So I was so devastated. I didn't know what I was going to come home to. I didn't know what the packages were going to look like. But guys, I had three packages waiting for me and they were soaked. <laughs> they were soaked to the bone, the boxes. So I got so nervous because I knew that there was at least one of them had a Funko Pop in it. So I was nervous. I didn't know if it was protected. I got really... Literally, the ink from the printed labels was unreadable. That's how hard it rained. That's how, that's how wet these boxes got. I literally had to throw the boxes away so they didn't stink. So unfortunately, I already unboxed these items just to make sure that they were okay and that nothing got damaged. But we're good. I'm happy to say that nothing got damaged. Everything was good, including the pop. The pop came in good condition. So... I got three boxes, so I have everything in the bag, so I'm just going to show you guys. So thankfully, it was a horror story that it was sat out in the pouring rain, but I was at work. I couldn't get to it, unfortunately, sooner. So, but thankfully, everything was okay. We're good. We're hunky-dory. So I already unboxed everything, so I'm just going to show you everything that I got. So, first off, from my gamer and Twitch friend, Michelle, she sent me a pop, and she said, I'm sending you a little bit extra, so I didn't know what. So I will link Michelle down below. Um... She's the one that sent me the Rick and Morty pop recently, so she sent me, she saw that I had recently in a uh, mystery box on eBay, I unboxed a, I still don't know how to say the name right either, a Rack Bath, a Wraith Beth, a Wraith Beth, I'm not sure. So anyways, I unboxed a vaulted one, so she sent me the Hot Topic exclusive, it's like the, um, the patina, I think is what they're calling these, the patina, so it's the Hot Topic exclusive patina, I cannot say that name, I cannot pronounce it right, but anyways, Michelle, my good YouTube and gamer and Twitch streaming friend, she sent me that, and she also sent me another little extra goodie here, she sent me this Crossbones from Civil War, this Pocket Pop, I don't have that, so I was excited to add those, so thankfully this came protected, I was so excited, so this did not get damaged, the boxes were soaking wet, the ink ran on the packages, but thankfully nothing was damaged or destroyed. So then I had two other packages, so I just kind of combined them in the bowl. Thankfully nothing in there was damaged. So we got from there, we got a Pennywise pop pen or pop pencil. Come here, Georgie. Come here, Georgie. Oh, still not a, still, I don't like clowns. I don't like, I'm okay with Pennywise, but I don't like clowns. Oh, they freak me out. So then we got a Digimon. It's not like a pocket pop, but it's like a, um, like a key figure. So we got Digimon. So that got sent to me as well. Is this thing missing? Oh, I thought it was missing a leg. I thought that was just one really skinny leg, but it's not missing a leg. So let's go. So we got that in the mail with the pencil. We got a American Horror Story um, bandana. So we got that in the mail. That's cool. We got a Rick and Morty pen. We got a Rick pen. We got... Um, some Star Wars Legos, Darth Vader, so we got some Star Wars Legos in the mail. I really wish I could have unboxed these, but guys, you don't understand, the boxes were like, I wish I would have at least saved one box, but I didn't want it to make my house stink, so I had to throw them out. They were literally soaked to the bone. This I thought was really cool, so I don't know how well you can see, but it's a keychain Pokeball, and there's like a crystal, or like a white holographic Bulbasaur inside, so hopefully... The light doesn't reflect off the ball. Hopefully you guys can actually see that. I think this is so cool. A little bowl sore inside. Um, so once again, I forgot. Michelle, thank you so much for these. I really appreciate that. I really appreciate you reaching out to me and sending those to me. We have a Pennywise pocket pop or like a mini. So another little Pennywise. I think there's one more thing. Okay, so we got an Oogie Boogie. Um, a green. I don't know if this glows in the dark. I know there's like a glow in the dark pop, but I don't know if that glows in the dark. So we got those. And I think that's everything. Yep, so that's everything, guys. So I just wanted to share that with you really quickly. Again, thank you, Michelle. I will link her down below. Check out her YouTube. Check out her Twitch. Um, thank you so much for sending me these goodies. I really appreciate it. And I'm sure I'll be contacting you soon for more goodies from your collection that I would love to add to mine. So what do you think, guys? What was your favorite thing? I would say that this stuff and this little 
Bulbasaur keychain. Those are probably my favorite things. I mean, I love everything. I'm so happy to have this stuff. So thank you guys so much. Let me know down below. What did you think of these? Have you ever had a similar story like that happen? Have you ever had a uh, soaking wet box? And if so, what did you get? And what was the condition of it? That was my biggest fear. I was so nervous that everything was going to be damaged. But thankfully... I mean, it had sat out for a couple of hours. Like I said, I wish I could have shown you guys one of these boxes, but they were literally so damaged that I just had, I had to throw the boxes out. But just thankfully, everything inside was good. My pop, the pop was my biggest concern. So thank you again, Michelle. Thank you everybody for checking this video. Let me know down below. What was your favorite thing? Have you ever had something like that happen to you? You had a wet box of salt. What was the contents and what condition were they in? Thank you guys so much. My name is Mikey Vintage. As always, guys, collect what you love. Happy hunting. And until next time, bye guys. Uh -huh.